Good morning guys, it's just about 1 p.m. I've been up for a little while. I had my dressing change, I went for my walk with my mom, and we have a few things that we have to do today. But I can finally, 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 she's being funny. I can finally, finally, finally tell you guys what's been in the works for like two months now um, that I didn't tell you guys. And, Basically, we're leaving the country. We are going to Europe for the first time and we are going to be going to France. So this has been in the works for months upon months upon months. And um, actually the day that we bought the, the plane tickets, literally like 30 minutes after we bought the, t brought, bought the tickets, I had my second seizure. Um, and we've just been going back and forth with like if I was healthy enough to go or not because um, of everything going on they just were everybody was really iffy about um, you know if it was safe or whatever but we are going we are going in a month we're going June 8th to June 15th and um, there's a lot of like stresses that are going on about it because I have to figure out sending like my medical supplies over which is free but I don't know it's like a whole process with that and then um, we're buying travel insurance right now and we had to get a certain type because we needed the medical coverage so it's been just really 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 back and forth um, and oh and we also I'm buying a wheelchair for it um, because I'm just my body's I'm going for walks every day with my mom we're trying to walk a few miles just to keep my stamina up but I know you know like when you're going around and visiting a, a country you know like that's gonna be a lot of walking for a normal person and if I'm struggling and you know, only doing a little bit um, I want I would rather be um, I'd rather I, I don't want to be in a situation where we're stopping five minutes um, you know every 20 minutes we're stopping five minutes because I need to sit down I just want to be able to have the um, accessibility so you know we're gonna make um, arrangements for me but we figured that the arrangements are um, worth like sacrificing a little bit of the trip is worth um, going you know like it's it's like it's really we should go and just kind of make things a little bit more accessible for me but we are going to be together in a different country and it's going to all be good so anyway i've just been like so i've been, like i just wanted to tell you guys so much and so it's nice to finally talk about it so now i can be more open with you guys and basically today um we want to travel insurance today or tomorrow so we have to reser uh, make reservations for a bunch of different things so that's what we're going to spend a couple hours doing i'm also going to be planting my seeds today so today is going to be a good day um me and my sister are just hanging out we have rosie here right I'm gonna try to have the eggs and my sister made this for me. Okay, so since I'm feeling decently okay and I know recording this video won't take very long, I am setting up to do a video just quickly on EDS. I want it to be like EDS in less than five minutes because a lot of videos that people put up are like crazy, crazy, crazy and so I want to just do, you know, a little bit more of a uh, quick video so that people can understand it in a short amount of time. So I just have to figure out a place to start recording it and I'm going to get on doing that. Hey guys, so I know this is probably an awful angle, but I just wanted to catch you guys up. It's 9 p.m. I recorded an EDS ver a video e earlier today. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I recorded an EDS video t earlier today, so hopefully that'll be up soon. By the time you guys see this, it'll probably be up, but I just wanted to update you guys on something that I haven't really talked about. Um, my dad's mom is going to be at 97 in August, so she's 96 right now. Um, and over the course of the past 
six, seven, eight months, um, she's kind of declined, but she was declining a lot slower, and then recently it's gotten really bad. So we know that um, obviously there's no way you know you can prolong like, and that's a long time to live. So um, it's not worth trying to do rehab or whatever. Um, it's more about just keeping her comfortable. But over the past couple weeks, she's really, 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 really declined, and. You know, we don't know how long she's going to be alive for. Um, it could be tonight, or it could be two weeks from now. You know, we don't we don't know. Um, so me and Adrian went last week, and um, I've been going with my family. I'm going to try to go tomorrow, um, and then potentially on Friday with Adrian because she asks about him all the time. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah, between my normal issues and, you know, that and everything, I'm just crying off and on um, a lot recently, so. But I just wanted to update you guys. I hadn't really spoken to you guys about it, so I just wanted to let you know what's going on with that. Um, just so when something does happen, like, you guys knew about it before I say anything, so. Um, I'm going to go watch TV with my mom and sister, and I will catch up with you guys soon. Hey you guys. Oh. I'm up alone. With my me time that I have every night. Um it's twelve twenty one. I took my medication, my like sleep meds, um a little while ago. And basically my plan for tonight is to just pick up my room. Um anybody who has a chron chronic illness um can attest to this that there's things that usually go out the window, um, certain things that you can, you just kind of have to not think about <laughs> or not worry about it as much as you should. And like for me, it's laundry. Like, it's hard th keeping things clean for like a normal person. Like pre sick Liz, it, that was something I struggled with. But now that I have an excuse, it makes it a lot worse. <laughs> um, no, but seriously, it does take a lot of energy to kind of, not even laundry, but just keeping a place tidy. I try when I leave Adrian's house, um, the basement, his room, or like the, yeah, our room. Um, before I leave, I try to like, not necessarily put the laundry together or anything, but like, like throw all the dirty stuff into the hamper then make a pile of the clean stuff and I'll try to like vacuum and throw things out that need to be thrown out there's usually IV supplies everywhere um so I like try to do that so that when I leave um the four days that he's working you know he doesn't have to worry about it um and he can just you know take his clothes off and throw it all over the floor you know and do whatever he wants but I yeah, I'm not working, so I don't exactly have an excuse, and to be honest, it looks better than it is. This is a very, very, very big pile. It doesn't look like it is, but I promise it is. So, I think I just have to do it tonight. I just got to attack it. Okay, so basically, as you can see, I just made a much more put together mess. Hold on. I gotta, I gotta turn the lights on. Oh, I'm stuck. Ah. This thing, I swear, all it wants to do is trip me. Okay, so this is like, ignore that. That's that's no. So then, see, this is like the tops. This is all my leggings, cause all I wear is leggings. And then this isn't as bad as it was. I mean, that's just a blanket, so nobody has to worry about this. And nobody has to worry about the whatever about that. So now it's a much more organized mess. 
Hey, I think I did a good job. I like un crazy the leggings and stuff like that. But the reason I pulled up this actually was because um, like a week ago or something, I uh, told you guys about the tea and chocolate um, gift thing that my sister gave me and I have not tried the chocolate and I wanted to sh try it and show you guys. It is tea infused chocolate covered caramels. So I just wanted to have this so it's a forever memory. God damn. Are you serious? Why is this like this? Damn, man. I'm so afraid I'm gonna end up having all all four of them tonight. But I can't, I can't, I can't do it. I'm gonna have one. Okay, so here's what it looks like. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's really good. But it's like decadent where you don't want to have more than one. Mm. Very good. Tea infused chocolate caramels. <laughs> Literally, directly after I um, turned the camera off, it fell. Now, one is missing. One is good. It's in the container. I just went to go stand up. So there was one that was... I don't, I don't know. And the thing is, I'm not wearing my glasses, so I can't see. So I can see the messed up one. It's right here, so I'm gonna eat it. Mm -hmm. But I don't know where the, I don't know where the other one is. <sighs> I'm such an idiot. I found it. Does that mean I have all of them? Yes! Because I just ate two. You know, I have two left. On that note, I'm going to close the vlog out. Um, I do also want to put in today that I've kind of held back um, from anybody in my family, really, or anybody at all, really, um, knowing how I was feeling about a lot of things today. I do want to put in that, like, I'm trying to be happy and, like, I'm trying to push myself and, like, physically for this trip now and and emotionally and just do what I just need like need to do but because of things that have been going on um, I am very you know I'm just I'm just dealing heavily with depression um, and it doesn't it doesn't help that my you know my grandma's in the situation she's in right now and you know like I just I felt we recently that my health maybe is declining a little bit but I don't know like I don't know if this is a temporary decline um, I know what I have doesn't really go into remission um, so it's just like I, I don't really know what's going on with a lot of things and um, just off and on I'm, I've been crying today I didn't want my family to see me um, but I just, I don't want to, like, sit here and, like, just complain about it. I just wanted to say, basically, that, like, this is behind, like, somebody could act fine in front of everybody else, but be really, really, really distressed alone. Um, again, I don't want pity or anything. I'm just saying to keep that in mind, basically, so... Sorry for this, you know, ending on a heavy note, but I will see you guys tomorrow. I don't know what I'm, I think I'm seeing my grandma tomorrow. I think that's the only thing, like, I'm planning on doing, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.